Welcome to the Resetting the Oracle Apex Admin Password video. This tutorial is brought to you by MNS Consulting. This tutorial assumes that you have sys level access to the database that Apex is installed against. We will be using Apex version 3.2 for this demonstration. The full article with screenshots of previous versions can be found at the link shown on your screen. Oracle recommends that the Apex admin password be changed at an original install and during any migration from runtime to development mode. It may also be necessary to change it due to security policy or to, due to a change in the actual person who administers the Apex system. Changing of the Apex admin password is fairly simple and does take just a few moments to complete. In order to change the password for the admin account, you do need to be within a SQL command prompt. So, first thing we need to do is get to one. Go start, run, cmd. Bring this up a little closer here. We need to then navigate to the directory that the Apex system was installed from on this machine. That's d apex32 slash apex. Here we log on and connect with the, CQ, with the SQL plus command designating the sys as the sysdba role. We hit enter and we give it our password and this will give us a SQL prompt. We type in the at sign and then apx ch pwd and hit enter and this will execute the script that changes the admin password. Enter the new password and you're done. Type exit twice to get out. Now we'll test to make sure that the change took. So we'll go start programs, Oracle Express Edition, start database homepage to bring up our Apex homepage. Then we will manually go and navigate to our Apex administration page. Please note that when you force change the password in this fashion, it will force a change at first logon. We type in the password, we fed the SQL command, and as you can see, it says we must change the password. Please keep in mind any security restrictions or guidelines that may be in place where you are in terms of password security. Change the password again, it says it's changed, and one final logon to make sure that it worked. And the password change took. We hope you found this video useful, and we'll see you again.